Hello. <clears throat> Just wanted to film a quick intro uh, for this video. Um, made this video because uh, I played a game with uh, Steve uh, from Play the Game channel. I'll go ahead and I'll link that channel somewhere in the description. Um, and when we were playing, we played against uh, Hella. Um, using the Galactic Artifacts and Future Past modular sets because both of those have uh, uh, side schemes with victory um, in them and so it would add a lot of side schemes to the victory display. Each side scheme in the victory display gives Hella plus one scheme plus one attack and plus three health per player. Um, and then the goal of that game was to like you know get really big attack and schemes um, and Steve was playing um, a protection deck that used the stand togethers to prevent all the damage from a really big attack and then hit the, the villain with the, the, the big attack right back at him. Um, we ended up losing that game um, for, you know, several reasons. Um, but ultimately, the, the big problem was the thwarting out. Um, And the fact, you know, the, of how we went about. We, we, we had some questionable strategies. But regardless, um, Steve was had we really hoped that somebody would have played Jean Grey using uh, Psionic Manipulation to help counter some of the really big thwarts or uh, schemes that the villain would be putting out. Um, so Psychic Manipulation, whenever the villain schemes, um, this activation removes threat instead of placing it. So... It allows Jean Grey to interrupt, and so if the villain's scheming for 10 threat, uh, she can instead remove 10 threat, which would have been really helpful in that game. So me and my buddy, uh, Mike, decided to go ahead and give this a shot, and uh, this is how it went. All right, so... Um, we're making this one for uh, Steve because oh, he uh, wanted to do uh, Jean Grey with uh, Psychic Manipulation. Um, against uh, Hella with Galactic Artifacts and uh, Future Past in it because... She's going to get really big from all of the victory uh, side schemes going to the victory display. So she'll have a huge attack and a huge scheme. Also, we have the stand togethers in here. Yeah. So it's Captain America Protection with uh, Phoenix Justice. So we have the stand togethers, which will prevent the damage and deal that big amount of damage back to her. And this was what Steve was wanting to play with us the other day, or or play the other day. But he uh, nobody nobody played Phoenix for him, so I put together a Phoenix deck. So this is for Steve. Um, anyway, I guess we are at the point where so we've got everything in the deck. We got obligations in the deck, side schemes in the deck already. Shuffle a little bit. All right, so. Go ahead and I guess we draw and start. I've never played Phoenix, so this will be fun. Because I don't recall ever playing Phoenix. I played her a couple times. Yeah. Um, you kind of got to make the decision if you want to go to leave her unleashed or move back and forth or that kind of thing. Or leave oh. her leashed <laughs> or leave her restrained. Okay. Restrained. <laughs> Keep her on the leash or let her off the leash. <laughs> That would be awesome if it was like leashed and unleashed. Um, so anyway, yeah, look at that. So do I start restrained then? I start restrained, restrained with three and I get tokens. four counters on it. Oh, let me change the counter type. <clears throat> I'm gonna make it a little bit bigger. And those are going to give me a resource. 
in the other side. Right. Okay, so let me look at what cards I got. I got oh Phoenix, that's an event. Um telekinetic shield, I don't think I need that. Um steady restraint. I mean that seems good, but I don't think I need it. Um I think we're just gonna go for a big one. Big mulligan. Um, oh my god, I got a power of justice and no. Okay. Well, this is this is not what I wanted. But we'll make it work, I guess. Um So we have Garm. He starts with tough, right? Um well, I've got an extra resource, potentially, if I need it. But I really want to play the White Hot Room. I feel like that card's brilliant. Because um, it's going to give me a fee. Eh, maybe I won't. Maybe I'll just pitch it this time through. Um, so I'm going to use a resource. And... Annoying drawing both Xavier and Nick Fury on the first turn. I got them both too. Do you really? <clears throat> yeah. Oh, God. And Agent 13. Which one? What are you Are you going to. Okay. You're going to play one of them? I was considering Hero Kill, actually. And Super Soldier, so. Alright. Well, I'll play. Is that how much I just spent? Sorry, I lost track. So I had a six card hand, right? Mm. And I spent one, so there we go. You know what? I'm going to keep this in case I draw a justice with Nick. I'll draw three. And I got the inflatable coolers. But I did draw a justice. Draw my stupid card at the same time. Um, question is, what do I want to play? Did you give me an X-Men? Final X-Men? I did not. There's no way I'm giving you my X-Jet anyway. So, <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Just being honest. <laughs> All right. Um, but I'm going to give you a mansion, I think. Well, that might change what I'm doing. Then. Go ahead and have a draw. Um... Do we want? Can we kill Garm? He needs eight. Well, we we can. We can't remove threat from here until he's dead, right? Yeah. Right. That's so. Um, Either one way or the other, I can't, I can't remember which way. So I'll knock the tough off. This threat cap's really high. So we don't have to, thirty-six. So we don't have to worry about that right now. So I'm gonna knock the tough off with Phoenix and then punch him for two, with Nick. All right. All right, your turn. Is she steady at all? Or? No, she can be stunned all the heck and confused. So, hoping to go unleashed so I can do that a lot. I'm not going to play. Actually, I got my freaking discount, though. I really want to play. Gotta get oh right shit! I field. used your discount. Pardon my language. Oh, you? oh, you did? Okay. Um, yeah, I would. I would have used it, but that would have changed oh. everything. I would have given you a broken tuition instead of a card. Yeah, whatever. You're, you're, it's wasted. All right, it's gone. I uh, would have played my X Jet and heroic intuition instead. All right, so understand that this game needs to get worked out. <clears throat> To say you could play Xavier, but how oh, you want to get you. Wait a second. If you played your, if you used your helicarrier to play your combat, your uh, serum, super soldier serum, 
this better plan. Yeah. Because then you use that to play. Yeah, well, you, no. You didn't. How would you use play your shield? What did I use to play my oh, shield? Oh, you're fine. You, yeah. You can. So, sorry, I messed you up, dude. Get out. So you had, no, you had your helicarrier in play. Helicarrier in. Picasso there you toy. go. Sure, like that. Yeah, Just exactly. There. You can keep it. Yeah, yeah that's true. Right. Oh, and then two on this guy. I guess you could punch him for another two if you wanted to, but yeah. Got him to flappable. You'd rather you want to keep the unflappable? That's totally yeah. fair. All right. Um. So ready, draw. Got two psychic manipulation. All right, so two thread on. <clears throat> All right, yep. That's all right. She's going to activate against me. I'm going to defend with Nick. Nick is defeated. She's going to activate against you. Or no, he's going to activate against me next. He'll hit me for two. And then he's going to activate against you. Or three. So she's hitting you for two. Two plus three. Ooh, under fire's gone at least. So she hit you for five total, minus your defense. So but she takes one, yeah. Yeah, we got her. First blood. Alright. Um now it is uh her encounter cards, right? Oh I forgot this thread on. Encounter cards. She gained stalwart. Look at that. I lied about being able to stun her. And Hercules Cloak. Attached to the enemy with the lowest attack. Let's put that on Garm. He's only got four points left. Yeah. See, he engages the first player. So, does he move with you? Does he move or does he stay? I think he moves, right? Your first player now? No, I think he just engages. Okay, he just comes into play against the first yeah. player. I don't, but it's, yeah, it's weird, right? That doesn't matter. He's going to die here anyway. It's your turn. All right. Uh, tenacious. Get the super soldier serums out, right? Yeah. Hey, get them. You have them all, both out on the second turn. That's pretty good. Strike. All right. So I roll plus one to strike to end the game. I roll four for four. Move forward to four. You want me to punch? I'm trying to say. What do you think is better, killing Garm or moving in the fourth thread? I'm trying. I don't know. Probably should kill, kill Garm. Killer to, yeah, he's got that plus three. Yeah, he's he's a yeah five attack right now. So if we kill Garm, there's two. Yeah, three. Uh, and then you did one. I did two and one. I could punch him then for one. All right, my turn. I'm going to draw a card with Lockable my mansion. Down. All right. Um, we're going to kill him. I'm going to play this. I play. You got two of those or one? I believe I put two. Play Eros. Um, I'm going to punch him for one. He 
with Eros. I'm probably just going to leave Eros in the game for a while so you can have a Guardian if we need one. Um, I'll thwart for three. And he's victory. No, I'm going to thwart for one, two, three. I'll thwart for three off of here. And I will flip down. Did we get Odin? Actually, instead of doing that, no, we don't get him yet. No, yeah. it's, what's the? You get him once we clear all the side schemes. That's right. Instead of thwarting, I'm just gonna flip down and uh, recover, mm -hmm. and gain a counter. All right. Um. Our turn. Um, man. Uh, so three thread on, and then, oh, we are ready. She's going to scheme against me. I will, uh, I'm going to probably, yeah, I'll just go ahead and psychic manipulation it now. Two. Three, eight, one, two, one more card. I'm gonna get rid of Wraith, I think. Three. So, so she removes uh, three threat. Eh, not really worth it. And it's six threat. And then, oh, that was actually her attack against you. I screwed up. She's uh -huh. attacking you. You're gonna block with Ironheart, right? No, I was gonna block myself. And just oh. Well, she hits you for three, so you didn't need to play the jump foot flip. I won't play the jump foot. Take no damage, no draw card. Um, and then uh, she schemes against me for the exact same outcome. All right. Encounter cards. Salt. She's attacking you. I think I'm going to block this one. Sounds good. Take, yeah, takes enough to kill Ironheart. Um, place one threat on the main scheme, plus one in, there's no, none in the victory display yet, so just the one. All right, uh, my turn. I'll draw a card. Whenever, oh, I already recovered. I'll flip up. Um, just pitch this. This, I guess, to play Sense of Justice. Um, I'll thwart for three. Oh, she right. took one retaliate from the. Actually, I'll hold on to this. Did you take? Did you do the retaliate from the first block? Yeah, yeah. I thought I did. Maybe I didn't. It's her. Right. She's at eighteen minus two, is what she should be at, right? My turn. Now it's your turn. Uh, double to jump flips. Mansion. Mansion. Draw card. Double. Puts up with a voodoo. And a sub toss. Discard <clears throat> five. Take one of that swamp. I got sub toss. What'd you just do? I played Brother Voodoo. Oh, Brother Voodoo. Uh, so I will take the super block. Not this one. I got discard cards on it. Yeah. Actually, I'll put this. I'll keep this shield block at eleven and toss it there. Keeping the shield toss. I'm sorry, shield toss. Yes. And oh, you're gonna use it to ready. Yeah. All right. I'll toss the shield. I'll toss the toss. Ready. Yep. Uh, we'll 
puncher, I guess. Puncher for two. Yeah, puncher for two. Because brute voodoo can thwart for two. Yeah. Takes two. All right, ready and draw. Yeah. One, two, three, thread on. Now she's going to activate against me. I'm getting stacked here, man. <clears throat> you are loaded. Um, I guess I'll defend. Unless you can defend for me. I don't want to sacrifice heroes because he's our only guardian. No, I gotta... I'll de defend for you, I gotta... I just use Brother Voodoo for you. Brother Voodoo? Okay. He takes three. And then she's attacking you. I defend for myself. Hits you for four total. I will use jump foot. And uh, reduced by two, so that's back to five. So, so you don't take any. So, yeah, well, she takes one. So you draw a card. Yeah, oh, you got your nerves of steel finally. So you have your yeah. your lightning for defense cards. Yeah. All right. Yeah, um, encounter card. cards then. <clears throat> She got the shake weight. Shake weight. It's actually a really bad one, right? Because you need three lightning to get rid of it. Actually, do these uh, attachments count for discarding when she dies? Yeah. Because when she flips, it says, after you flip to the defeated flipper. Oh, wait, where is it? It's on this card. It's on this one. Okay. Discard, Discard each, each attachment. Yeah. So, yeah, so if we... We defeat her, we'll get rid of the shake weight. So if we <clears throat> get rid of it by doing 13 damage to her, also. Right. Or we just play with triple lightning because that's an encounter card. Yeah, triple yeah. lightning's hard. Although if you play your queen carrier, you can actually do triple lightning. Yeah. Um, anyway, you have an encounter card, so. Take one indirect damage and then take one indirect damage for each. That's going to kill somebody if we have 10 in the victory display. Yeah. Excuse me. I should have put some uh, symbiote suits in here. Yeah. <laughs> Your turn. Favorite. All right. Um, double carrier for a queen carrier. I'll draw a card for genius. Uh, I guess genius will put in my lightning gallery. There you go. Um, and then get rid of myself. Uh, actually, nope. actually, you want to take that back and use this instead. You can use it. All right. Get a carrier. Yeah. Should I guess, yeah, always use your super soldier service first, right? Yeah. And, and then the I will. Queen carrier dump. also, right? Yeah. Dump that for the thing. And All right. Pretty good. My turn. Yep. I will uh, draw a card. Got Mockingbird. It's not bad. Actually, and first. you have the Queen Carrier. Or the Healer Carrier. <clears throat> Let me use one. Oh, and the Helicarrier. I'll use the Helicarrier in Strength. Play Mockingbird. Mockingbird's going to thwart from here. Might be a mistake. It's going to put a hound into play, right? Is that the next one? No, this one. Scourge. No. So I get, you get Scourge, right? To the mm -hmm. first player. Mm -hmm. The first player reveals, yeah. And then I get an encounter card. That's fine. Let's just make it happen. So I'm going to draw a card for getting rid of that. Boo. You got confusion coming up? I, I cannot confuse her because of, uh, or stun her. Oh, star, star. Because yeah. of the stalwart, damn it. Yeah, we need to get rid of her armor. Um, 
because I'd like to do confused and stalwart things to her. Um, uh, do this. I'll get rid of his top for later. I'll remove four threat from the main scheme or do one, two, let's put this on here. Then yeah, I'll use this, this to remove four threat. All right. Um, I'm just going to flip back down, I guess. Ready and draw. We have a mind control. Can I mind control him? Not elite. I think everything is elite in here. Mm -hmm. uh, there are no non elite minions in this game, so my mind control is kind of useless. But it's alright. So. Uh, we're going to put two threat on, then she's going to attack you. Got to stand together, and you got the arrows. I What's do. Swinging at? She's attacking you currently for three plus a boost, and she has a plus one to that boost. So it's a minimum four plus a boost. So if you want to... Exhaust. You can take three from three from Scourge. Though. You'll take three from Scourge then, yeah. You got a Mockingbird? Oh, I can block with Mockingbird if you'd like. Yeah, absolutely. Let's do that. I'll block her with Mockingbird. She hits Mockingbird for six. Because I'll block Surge with myself. He takes one. Okay. You don't take any. You draw a card. Yeah. Ooh, you get an encounter card. Thanks. <laughs> She's going to scheme against me. She's scheming for a minimum of four against me as well. So I'm going to use my psychic manipulation. Just do, do that. Psychic manipulation. Oh, she gets a night sword. She has piercing now. But I remove four. All right. Encounter cards. Bastion. Jesus Christ. Okay, here comes. Advance. Oh, double advance. We're going to be putting 8 thread on, 10, 11, 11 thread on. Wow. And then night, the portal. Player order, so it's got 6. I feel like that's another one we need to get rid of. Um, Your turn. My turn. Yikes. Okay, I'll draw a card. Um, neither of them are non elite. <laughs> I will flip up. He's just got 10. Pretty tough. He's swinging at. He's swinging you. Play Quake. He pulls a card. So I can kill Scourge. Oh, you can? Right? Oh, no, I can't. Oh, yeah. One. He's got nine. Two, three. So I'm going to teleconnect attack him for seven and punch him for two. He gets oh, removed. Victory. Yeah. Um. And then I'll three. thwart. Wow, he's, uh, he's worth some, some cash there, man. Thwart three, for three. three. I'm going to draw a card now. Let's see which one's in the purple deck. All 
right, your turn. Mm. Got these crappy stand togethers. Mm. Defense cards. <clears throat> We'll throw a stand together to stand up. <clears throat> Got Starhawk also, I guess. Just pay three for Starhawk. Oh, so he is three. He's only two. Uh, I mean, you're right. He's only two. I meant, yeah. I, I thought he was three. I was kind of. It's all good. Um. Then you could thwart for three and get rid of this. Yeah, that's what I think we'll do. I was thinking about knocking the tough off here. Yeah, <clears throat> knocking the tough off is also good. But the tough will go away when he attacks you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Just look on the bright side. Mm. Um, all right, ready and draw? Yep. I guess I could have drawn a card off skill investigator. see if I want it. It's another skilled investigator. I'll hold on to it, I guess. like to knock off these uh, attachments. All right. Um, her turn. So two thread on. She's going to activate against me. I'm going to block with Quake. Quake is defeated. Uh, she's going to activate against you. I'm going to drop a shield block. Okay. So. Wow. <laughs> it's crazy. So she hit you for what? Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. All right. That's block. <clears throat> oh, I just took no damage. Okay. Draw a card. Right. And he attacks you for two plus a boost. I am going to rock him. And I'm going to play jump with as well. Okay, you don't need to. He only hit you for three. No, no, I'm not. I mean, I guess you could, but oh, no, you can't because you're not even taking damage, right? But I guess. Yeah, you're not taking damage. But he loses his tough. Oh, and she takes one from your tally. I did that on my Oh, you did it. My bad. Yeah. Right. Oh, he didn't have to do that. Yeah. The counter cards. Yeah, you get two. Oh, it's right. exhaust. Surge. Oh, and she's Hang attacking up. me. Fart. Um, you have a guardian now, so I'm just gonna let Eros go. Okay. Are you telling me I gotta hold on to freaking Star Driver now? Well, he's easy to hold on. He keeps going back to your hand. Yeah. It's still teapot. Oh, we didn't do the thing. Okay. In player order, each player discards the top two cards and takes indirect damage equal and over boost this way. So we should have done that. Just do it two. now. I take five. Well, I was going to say that to me, but okay. Oh. You can take it. Oh, I forgot you had two hit points. And you take three. I did add two hit points. One, two, three. All right. Um... Boo. Alright, what's your card? Assault. Uh, assault, so she's attacking you. Yeah. Okay, well, this, um, what's she in you for? Three, four, five, six, six plus a boost. We well, have jump flip, you said, right? That's only two. That's still four damage, man. 
Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm saying you weren't going to die, that's all. But yeah, you can defend with the Starhawk. Go ahead. I need to draw her. I need to kill her. Get rid of these attachments. Although the problem is, is she's got one card left, so we want to do it next turn. Oh yeah, because don't always I need to make this card pop. Yeah. <laughs> but he can be stunned. Yeah. All right, so I will um, one of these and this one. This one I want six. Stuff in Oops. That's an extra card. That's a boost. Yeah, I figured we'd do the teapot. I don't know. Or do we just go for her? Oh, you know what? I forgot she gets hit points every time. So we put two in there. So she has 12 more hit points. Um, do you need me to throw up the two? I don't know what the right, right thing is. Maybe we just go for her. Um, can we? If you remove... I got another two with Fred of Voodoo. Just trying to think about how to. Oh, you're going to play Voodoo? You should play Voodoo first. Because <laughs> you might get an event that you want to play. That's all. Those two I can't play. Oh, can I board? I got two resources. So I can do a heroic strike, one of six. I can either kill him or do six damage to her, or I can do a fierce determination and tort for three, and then another two for my voodoo. But... Well, if you, so you have, wait, put these in. What's in your hand? Oh. Oh, 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 they're not in your hand. You can, you're can you choosing which one you want. Yeah. Um, well, oh. I don't want to take one of those. So yeah, I so... Choice between thwart or six damage. I think maybe do the thwart. And then you can get rid of this. Yeah. I think maybe we just go for her. Toss that. Draw card. Move three. No, from this three. one. Oh, from that one? And then... Oh, we want to do that one. Let's get we want the to do another bad guy. Yeah. No. That's the plan. Because I can stun and confuse him. Alright. Um, then Voodoo can... Voodoo will do the two also. You're still exhausted. See? I haven't done the three. Oh, I... Well, what was the first three, then? So there's five here. See, so Voodoo's oh, taking... Oh, I'm sorry. I... I... Didn't know you took off the three already. Yeah, sorry. Okay. Okay. Um, six threat. This guy comes to you. He's tough, right? Um, my turn then, right? Actually, should I put the? You don't need to. Um, um but you could play. You could play Agent Thirteen. How'd we get? How'd you get her? I played the Fierce Termination. Do a card. Oh. Yeah, play Asian 13. Heck yeah. What? 
<laughs> she just like flew across the table. She comes to play your move two threat. Plus a new move two with her. Do we, do we, do, do, we do the main scheme or do we do the side scheme? I don't want this extra encounter card. I'll do this one then. Ends. And then she can thwart it again. I can get rid of it now. Um, And then I'm taking a pool of damage. Okay. Well, he's stunned and he's going to be stunned. Oh, is he? They're both going to be stunned. All right. At least that's the plan right now. I'm going to go unleashed. Um, so. I'm going to start by playing Iron Heart. Iron Heart get rid of this stuff. Oh, I'm on leash now. What happens? So I flip over. Yep. Now you have um, one, three, two? Something like that. So I got to get to four counters to flip back. Yeah. Let's just hope we don't get a... What you got to do on the other side is the problem. Face that Give you that. I'm just going to play play that to remove four threat. I'm just going to pitch both of these. Oh, wait, I don't need to pitch the helicarrier. I can use this. So it removes four threats, and, and it stuns and confuses an enemy. So I remove four threat from here. I'm going to stun and confuse. So she gets another three hit points. And then I heal four, because I got rid of the teapot. All right. All right. So we just need to kill this guy. Get, oh, she got, you gave her the more hit points. Yeah, I gave her Get rid of this and then kill her. So we got to do 51 damage. Thanks. <laughs> That's all. Um, boom. Um, all right, so. What do you have? Six cards. Because I'm bad at math. <laughs> Sorry. Um so two thread on. Mm -hmm. Activating against you first. I'm just gonna play shield block. Okay. It's a reasonable solution, right? Yeah, so it's it's a lot of damage. It's two, three you got four side schemes removed from play right now. I'm just going to put four counters here. Right. Oops. Uh, four side schemes. So it's one, two, three, seven, nine damage. Yeah. Shield block. Shield block. And you draw a card, right? She can activate against me. I'm going to block with Iron Heart. Happy to see gang up go. These guys are no longer stunned. Um, encounter cards. Actually, no, I do have a guardian? No. I don't have a guardian either. Nobody has a guardian anymore. Uh, should I have gotten two cards? Well, four. This, oh. oh, you're right, you're right. Sentinel tech, victory touch. You get your Sentinel nemesis. A minion. Oh, Brack, you can kill me. Got freaking quick strike. That's two. So, Han, does this attach before he gets into play or after he gets into play? 
What? Yeah, I can break strength. Oh, there's no pluses on it. It doesn't matter. Yeah. So I'm taking yeah, it just three. gives them more hit points. So he's attacking you for three. I mean, you also have Baron Voodoo to block with if you wanted to. Um, you might want to I save the resource. I don't know. Although it is a jump flip, it's a good resource, right? Um, but we can't get rid of this yet till we get rid of him. No rog. Yeah, so I'm going to block two to three. Um, and he takes one from retirement. Yeah. And then we move two threat from the scheme, main scheme. All right. Second card. Hello, taxi. Place one threat on each side scheme. Jesus. So you're going to kill me. Block with Brother Voodoo, right? Yeah. Two, two threat goes on the main scheme. All right, my card. Hello, attack. Ooh. Um. Yeah, that's not good for us. Can I borrow your ally? Mm. I should have gone alter ego. So this card gets a number of boosts equal to the number of side schemes in the victory display. So it's 4 plus 4 is 8 plus 3. So Agent 13 was hit for 11. Yeah, this is where we need our, our guardians. Where are our guardians? All right, your turn. Yep, my turn. Um, oh, hon. What? Uh, I think you need to put two threat back on because it says when I'm engaged with, I can't thwart. Is that considered a thwart? In this no, I don't. Flip? It's a de it was a defense. It's not a thwart. Okay. All right. Um. I wish they were all engaged with me. Psychic Blast would be nice. <laughs> Why? Deals four damage to each minion engaged with you. Ah. Uh. Um. It's almost like you need a shield toss right now. Mm. I'm gonna draw a card. And see what happens. Nope. I got a hat. I can give you a card, I guess. Go and draw a card. Ah! There it is. Shield toss, baby. So you can do four damage to each of them. Which would get rid of Bastion and almost get rid of Baron Zemo, right? He's got nine hit points. No. Um, do you have any allies that you're going to play this turn? Shield toss, but the uh, um, Mockingbird can stun cards. him. Can stun a minion also, so she could stun Nidhog. Nidhog, yeah. So I need three cards. Um, well, you got your hat. Well, I'm throwing that away and probably your hat. Away. Stand together and then stand together. Costa or Ironheart. Yeah, grab Costa, I guess. And then she'd be nice to have a freaking shield block on there. Well, you can play both Ironheart and Mockingbird if you hold on to them, it looks like. Yeah. Because right. Ironheart would draw you a card, and then you can use that card to play Mockingbird. Mm -hmm. All right. Just wanted to look through it. Um, Why in the hell did Steve want to do this, man? Because <laughs> I uh, thought it was fun. Um, schemes. So we're not going to kill him. So I am going to, if you have the Omnish trait, you have four damage. So what I'm going to do probably is I'm just going to thwart for three off the main. Or, oh, it's only one now, isn't it? So I can attack for three instead. How about I attack Zemo for three? That'd be cool. That way you can kill him with a shield. No, shield mm -hmm. toss is only going to hit him for four, four, so he'll have one hit point. Oh, Mockingbird or Ironheart can kill him then. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to flip down. I feel like 
that needs to happen. I do have a psychic manipulation that I'm just going to hold on to. So I'm going to play my helicarrier, and I guess you have my helicarrier. Ooh, wait, I want to hold on to that too, but whatever. We'll just do it like this. So you have my helicarrier. All right. Your turn. My helicarrier and... Termination shield, four four nine him. I guess you can just draw another one with your fearless determination. See what you get. And you'll get a double resource. Nope, you got a punch in the face. Which maybe you play that instead of mockingbird. Um. So if you shield toss. Well, let's do that now, so we can get stuff out of my hand. So that's four to each of them. So that kills both of them, right? Yeah. This gets removed. This gets defeated. Right? He stays in the game now, I think. Who? Zemo. Yeah, but... Uh, but this is Ashton gone. Nanotech away. is gone. So he's got eight left. Nanotech's gone? Right, yeah, yeah, the victory, yeah. it's got victory. victory. So this can hit him for six, and you can punch him for two. I'm also going to punch him for her. Can't stun her, but oh. still six points on her. And then use, can I play Mockingbird? Wait, we need to kill her this to win the game. Yeah. So actually, we just put another. By the way, do we? No, we we still no, we didn't add another. Just get side screen. Um. Yeah, I can use Mockingbird to ready. Um. The heroic punch. So that's a good strike. That's ten damage. Ten. Then you finish him off. For Twelve. Mockingbird stand up, and then I'll move three threats since I have fearless oh, determination. There you go. Take three thread off of there. I have two block effects. I only got one. But well, the guys are all dead, so. The guys are all dead. Hopefully ba something bad doesn't happen. <laughs> the famous could, last words. I could use a freaking med scene on this block. First aid. Well, we didn't play it quite right. Oh, you got a guardian. I don't have the. Anyway, one, two, three thread on. Um, activating against me. I'm going to use psychic manipulation. So she's scheming for seven plus a boost of two. So she's schemed for nine. So that's pretty good. <laughs> Instead of nine threat going on, nine threat being removed. Um, all right, she's gonna attack you. I will. Uh, Mockingbird or not Mockingbird? Uh, Ironheart. Uh, Ironheart. Ironheart is defeated. And encounter cards. Yeah, I get to advance. Um, you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and play another uh, psychic manipulation. My whole hand, but I feel it's worth it. She moves another nine threat, right? No, seven threat. No, there's none on here. There's no boost, no. so it's only no seven boost. threat. But I feel it's good. We got that completely under. Oh, here you go, sir. It's actually not too bad. You can use your apartment. And if she draws an assault, you don't die. <laughs> oh. I get the freaking potion. You get this, me. but you can get rid of it. No, it doesn't kill you. It reduces your stats by one. Oh, it's the other one. It's too mental it's to get rid of it. It's not po it's not uh, poison. No, I have two mental. All right, your turn. My turn. Um, yep. Uh, oh. That should be I'm going to give you a card, because me drawing a card seems kind of ridiculous. Take one damage and toss it. Oh, it does damage to you. 
Yeah, draw a card. Yeah, you want to draw a card. You get an encounter card. I will play it with Kiri. Draw three. <laughs> so you can end up with that Starhawk in play in case you draw a Protectors. Yeah. No, I can't do that. No. But you, you can right. remove threat. I will stand up. Oh, oh, run. You still have a card out? No, you just got it because you exhausted your deck. Oh, exhausted my deck. Um, don't need shield toss. I'm not going to play more. You didn't yet. return your shield to your hand when you tossed it last turn, did you? I did not, but I will. I just realized it. Hopefully it didn't matter. Because you didn't defend. No, I flipped yeah. down. Yeah, so you'd have to re... Well, you flipped down because you got your obligation. But there was no... No attacks made against you personally, so you just have to play, replay it. You still have my my helicarrier, I believe. Or did oh, you do take I? it already? I don't think so. Then I'll take it. I played your shield. All right. Um. If you get rid of that side scheme, you can draw a card. And you get Odin. And we get encounter cards. You know, I think we may have missed an encounter card somewhere for one of these. Yeah. For when I got rid of the second one. We did it for the first one. I don't think we did it for the second one now that I say it. Gosh darn it. Oh well. Maybe we did. I don't remember. Mistakes happened. You're playing Starhawk. All right. Guess you can fist her. <laughs> For six. Six. Uh, and remove two threat. I think I'll just punch her. Four and four. Two and two. We need to get rid of this to be able to kill her. I understand. I'm just saying. Okay, like, that's fine. This is going to add three more, so we might as well just. Oh, well, you're not going to get rid of it now. Either way, right? Because you only had three threat removal at most. Because um, you want to hold on to your shield block. Yeah. I'm just going to stay down, I think. Because all the, me flipping up, all it's going to do is. Make it so that you have to defend for me. Right. And do you think, I mean, she's got four side schemes. I don't think she'll scheme out. No, not at uh, yeah. 36. I mean, she is plus well, nine at the time. 40, actually. Yeah, 40. Yeah. I probably should have recovered. I'll do that at the end of your turn. <laughs> All right, so she's attacking me. Next year's going to block. All right, so wait, we got to put threat on first. Three threat on. She's attacking you. Four, five, six, seven. A bunch. Yeah, seven plus a boost. No overrun. Oh, under fire. Goodbye. That's good. Perfect. Ten damage to Nick Fury. Oh, you did draw us so stand together. So you can hit her for ten damage. Uh, hold on. You, it would cost you four resources well, and exhausting fighting. you and Starhawk although I could help pay for it I believe but if you wanted to you could just let her take yeah they just it's fine go ahead and draw your encounter cards you get two more. Oh, wait a second. 
He activated against you. No, here. Remember. This was my boost against me. So one plus, uh, what's this, seven, so eight threat on. All right, no, there you go. Assault. So I will exhaust this guy and this guy and play this. Can't use your helicarrier. Either. That's an action. You can use the Gwyn carrier. Three. Four. There you go. And they got her. All right, let's see what she hits you for. Seven plus a boost. She hits you for nine. You prevent all nine and she takes it. There you go. That nope. goes to me. Yep. Um, hey, we're unleashed. So we get we get we get stuff. So search the encounter deck discard pound says Harry for Dark Phoenix and reveal her. Um, then remove this from the game. Hello. It says reveal her. It goes to me though. All right. This, this is what it's search your obligation. You know, give to team carry players. Then this comes into play. Well, into the world. All right. It's, you know, it is what it is. The egg. The egg. Where are all my allies? Um, so she's at eight. Your card. Oh yeah. Oh Nimrod, perfect. It's just who we need to see there. So I'm first player. How are we gonna do this? How are we gonna win this game? I need to flip up and I need to somehow not die after I flip up and I don't see how that happens right now draw a card on your turn I have a well, I can get rid of I can do oof. I can actually do a shit ton of damage do you have threat removal? Uh, you have brother voodoo. Yeah. And you can, if you can remove, do I have enough damage though? Because now I just have 18 damage plus three. 18 damage plus three. I can do 21 damage. Getting rid of this will put her to 20 hit points. So we can kill her. I mean 20 hit points. She gets three more now. Oh. I've been giving her too many hit points, I think. I think I gave her 12 hit points once. Well, she yeah, only gets six get, more. She only gets three in. She gets six more hit points. I was thinking 12. I think you were 12 hit points once. Well, because I think there were a couple of side schemes out. Yeah, whatever. So anyway, um, I'm just going to flip. I don't have that much thwart, though. You can play Brother Voodoo, thwart for two. You can ready yourself, thwart for two. All you need to do is remove four threat. Mm -hmm. And we win the game. So I'm just going to pass the turn to you. So it's your turn. You way overpaid for that, but that's all good. <laughs> He's three. He's three. Yeah, how did I overpay for it? How many cards did you discard? Did Two you... cards. Oh, I okay. I'm sorry. I I'm an idiot. Mm -hmm. Oh, maybe because I was planning on giving you my hero carry. That's she blocked it ready. And then no, no. Cards. Yeah, yeah. Wait, no, no. I'm giving you my hero carry to pay for him. Oh. 
Because you need to hold on to a card so you can ready yourself. I, I readied myself with the freaking shield block. Oh, oh. My bad. I'll hold on to the shield block. And I'm the carrier. sorry. I, you said you ready. I didn't see you ready yourself. Yeah, I did. With My bad. So, I'll hold on to the shield block. So you readied and yourself and removed ready two? And remove two. And then, and then I... move two with other food. Oh, I'm sorry. You Because you discarded the shield block made me think that you overpaid for no. playing Brother Voodoo. Um, so that's gone. I guess we all draw a card off of the side scheme being defeated. Um, <laughs> but at that point, uh, she gets another scheme here, so she gets another 12. But I've got two telekinetic attacks. So that's nine damage. And that's another... Nine damage. Boom goes the dynamite. All right. So we beat her. No. Uh, actually, this popped off, right? Oh, yeah, we got him back. But she's defeated. Yeah, she'll be defeated too. Just because he's angry. Yeah, defeating this side scheme um, gets rid of Odin and gives oh. each of us a face down encounter card. Yeah. Um, I think we may have forgotten the encounter card on this one. Wait, no. On this one. When this one was, when we defeated. Uh, oh, nipple R. Um, the person, one player gets Scourge, which was you, and then I get a face down encounter card. I think I may have forgotten that face down encounter card. I don't know for sure. Maybe I didn't forget it. Regardless, I'm pretty sure I gave her extra health also. <laughs> um, because I'm bad sometimes at math. Yeah. See, that was, that was pretty good. No, I think it was pretty close, actually. Yeah. So it's like interesting. This, this this was gonna be bad over here with freaking Bastion and and because that's you can only get three turns for this guy uh, at least. So that's three yeah. swings. Well, yeah, we weren't gonna, like if we we decide to deal with them, it was gonna take a while. But like, I don't think these were particularly good decks either. Um, they just kind of showcased. The psychic manipulation and the stand together is what they're trying to do. Yeah, I don't, um, think, I don't think stand together. It's too expensive. Excuse me. I mean, yeah, it, it prevented been... 10 damage and dealt 10 damage. But psychic manipulation was way better, in my opinion, right? Because it's only yeah. three. And you don't have to exhaust two characters. Whereas, you know, stand together... It's, you know, Alliance, so it's nice that I can help pay for it, but exhausting two characters to prevent damage and then deal that much damage to the attacking enemy, that's hard. Yeah, I think I would have preferred sidestep over jump flip, too. I mean, it's only one damage, but it prevents three. Now you want to try those um, decks we had out yesterday? My dog's losing his mind. <laughs> That's a puppy still. 